Imagine that, in an instant, without fanfare or explosion, 85% of all the matter in the universe simply vanishes. The first consequence wouldn't be an explosion, but a silent and brutal dismemberment. Our Milky Way, spinning at suicidal speed thanks to the invisible mass of its dark matter halo, would suddenly lose its gravitational anchor. The stars at the outer edges, including our Sun on its 230 million year journey, would stop orbiting and be catapulted straight into the intergalactic void, like stones released from a slingshot, transforming our galaxy into a ghostly procession of orphaned suns. On a larger scale, the disaster would be even more profound. Galaxy clusters, those majestic cosmic cities, would dissolve into a diaspora of lonely galaxies. Andromeda, hurtling toward us for a future collision, would slow down and begin to move away, forever cancelling our cosmic encounter. Even light would behave differently, the great mirages of gravitational lensing, those windows that allowed us to see the farthest reaches of time, would be extinguished, revealing a less distorted, but tragically emptier, universe. The cosmic web, the filamentary skeleton that gives the universe structure and channels gas to create new stars, would disintegrate completely. The universe would stop forming galaxies, its engine of creation would shut down forever. Although Earth and the solar system would remain bound by local gravity, our long-term fate would be sealed, leaving us an island adrift in an endlessly expanding ocean. Our night sky, over the course of eons, would slowly empty, becoming a bleak, black canvas with only our nearest neighboring stars for company. The cosmos would transform into an infinitely colder, darker, and lonelier place, proving that the substance we cannot see or touch is, ironically, the glue that holds us all together in the vastness.